In Logic Pro 10, if you wanted to create a blank MIDI region, you would have to pull up your pencil tool, and you do that by pressing the letter T on your keyboard and then pressing 2 for pencil. And you go to the grid where you want the MIDI region to be added to, and you click on that measure, and that creates for you a blank MIDI region that's exactly one measure in length. Now if you wanted this MIDI region to be longer, you'd have to jump to your pointer tool by pressing T and then T again, and then you're going to have to grab this bottom right corner and drag out. Now I actually don't like to drag MIDI regions to length. Instead of doing things that way, I'm going to create a blank MIDI region, the length of which will be informed by my locators up here. So let me drag my locator from 8 to 16 and I'm going to create a MIDI region just like before by pressing T2 and click anywhere within the range of my locators. Once I have a MIDI region I'm going to hold down my option key and backslash and it's going to expand my MIDI region to fill the range of my locator. Let me create another MIDI region again and just for the record I'm using a functionality that you can find under the edit menu. If you scroll down to trim, I'm using fill within locators. 